Everybody know what to do when everything goes right. Everybody know to show up and give everything they got when the sun shines. Everybody, when they get what they want, they're going to come and they're going to be great. But it's very few people that reach deep down and got the character that in the midst of opposition, in the midst of a challenge, to look at it with the right perspective and not only look at it with the right perspective, process it the right way and figure out a way to use it. What is it that will make it worth it for you? When you want to give up and things are working against you to face the rejections, what is it that will make it worth it for you to brainstorm and not be intimidated and say, I can do this. What is it that will make it worth it for you to make know your vitamin that you become empowered by it? What is it that will make it worth it for you to raise the bar on yourself and say, I got some more stuff in me when you want to keep driving past the office because of the stress? What is it that will help you get back up again? Some of us choose to stay down, but if that motherfucker who constantly gets up as fast as they can, those are the motherfuckers that make it in life. All you do is you fall down, get back up again, fall down, get back up again, fall down, get back up again. That's how you win. You've got to activate the thinker in you. Don't allow your emotions to control you. We are emotional, but you want to begin to discipline your emotion. If you don't discipline and contain your emotions, they will use you. You want to monitor your inner conversations, the things that you say to yourself. You want to watch them, and in watching them, you want to take charge. Oh, you really don't feel like it. You really don't need to do it. Forget all that. That's that inner conversation. Oh, you don't need to worry about trying to go into your own business. Forget that. You can't do that. What if you lose everything you've got? That inner conversation that stopped you from doing the things you want to do less, don't do that. Forget all that. And then I said, shut up. You'll get scared sometimes. Your mind will go blank on you. You've got to learn to stand up to yourself inside yourself. And short circuit, override that conversation that's always going on. 85% of what that conversation will tell you is negative. It will tell you you're tired when you really are not tired. It will tell you you can't do it. It will fill you with fear. So you've got to watch that conversation. And when you find it going on, you've got to stand up to it and say, I'm going to do this anyhow. I'm afraid, but I'm afraid not to do it. And I'm not going to let you stop me. You've got to stand up inside yourself sometimes and say, shut up. Some people you will allow to unnerve you. You can't do this. You don't have everything it takes. I shut up. I have got to do it. That's why you've got to learn to make a conscious, deliberate, determined effort to stand up inside yourself, working on yourself, watching that inner dialogue. It will determine the quality of your life. The biggest challenge that you will have in life is you. Because there's no enemy within. The enemy outside can do us no harm. You've got to sell yourself every day on your abilities, on what you're doing, on the goal that you want to reach. You're bombarded with negative stuff every day that beats you down and you will find yourself unconsciously engaged in self-destructive behavior. If you don't program yourself, life will program you. Don't complain. Don't talk negative. Average people use their time to complain. Average people talk problems. The greats talk solutions. Live your life with passion, with some drive. Decide that you're going to push yourself. You want to live life with energy and passion. You want to be happy. You got a lot to be thankful for. Most people won't do that. Most people give up on themselves easily. You know the human spirit is powerful? There's nothing as powerful. It's hard to kill the human spirit. You got to get this beast mode. Everything about you has to say, I ain't playing. If it's to have, I'm going to get it. And I ain't leaving none of it behind. It's my beast mode. If you want to get your butt out to bed, right from sunup to sundown, you can have the life that other people dream of. 